Having not grown up in the sport or had any prior uh, involvement in the sport at all, I was really surprised with how uh, welcoming and supportive the community in Gymnastics Queensland is. Whether it's people from my own club, people from different clubs, or even in the uh, the headquarters, I've always been able to, to reach out and ask questions about my own professional development, about questions about the sport in particular. So I've always found that there was someone to ask and somewhere to go. I chose to become a coach without any prior gymnastics experience because I found that I was developing a real love for fitness, a real love for sport in general, but not in the traditional gym setting, like personal training, all that sort of stuff. So I actually found that just coming through um, and learning a little bit more about gymnastics and being able to learn all the different gym sports, that it was something that I found I could really grow into, something I could really love and still get such performance from. And to become a coach is actually quite an easy process. I thought it was gonna be a lot uh, more confusing. I went through and I did what's called a gymnastics for all beginner accreditation, just learning the fundamentals of the sport, lots of gross motor skills, etc. I found for me, coaching has been so flexible. I actually started off my coaching journey while still working in hospitality and anyone that's worked in hospitality knows how grueling it can be, long hours, changing shifts all the time, weekend work, um, and I was always able to find time and fit in my coaching responsibilities as well. Since then, I've actually dropped hospitality and just been doing my coaching, which has been a dream. And I'm actually due to have a baby next year. And I found that my boss and working environment has been really supportive of that and been able to, to factor that those new responsibilities in that I'll have next year. I'd recommend anyone that's been thinking about getting involved in coaching, just to give it a go. Just to ask all the questions that you could possibly ask, find yourself a mentor within the sport. If you've got the passion for, for working with kids, if you've got the passion for learning and teaching, everything to do with the sport itself, all the little details, they can be learned down the line. I see myself progressing through um, rhythmic gymnastics more throughout my life. There's so many other avenues that I can take. I've actually already started my um, advanced coaching course. I know that one day I want to be um, along the high performance um, coaching, coaching line, so we'll see how we go.